this like this. This is the first video I've filmed on my phone because quite currently my camera setup is not working. The mic, the camera's okay, but the mic isn't working and I don't know why. And I've tried like everything. So I'm buying another microphone cable for it, which is like gonna be $12, so it's not that big of a deal. It's better than buying a whole new mic. But whatever, we're gonna try out this. Try out my phone with this little mic. I don't know how long this will work for. The phone has a lot of battery. I don't know. The dogs are with me. Um, we're in the studio right now. I'm trying to work on my first New Year's intention, which um, is more art. So I am trying to do like more in 2019 and 2018. I'm trying to put more content out, mostly for myself. Filming videos is fun and I don't care if no one watches them because it's still fun to film videos and learn video editing and just do all that stuff. So, but everyone else is filming like a 2019 New Year's resolutions video and I thought hey I'll just work on one of my resolutions while I film this video so my first see I hate the word resolutions so a friend of mine said to make it intentions like things that you want to happen in the new year but that don't have to happen like like you're not a failure if you don't do these things you know what I mean my first intention is more art which I'm an artist and I really have trouble making art if I don't feel like making art so I think in 2018 I only did a couple of pieces um, I did like a self-portrait piece which I don't know where that is yeah don't, don't know where I put that and I did like a hand piece and I'll put like clips in of those but those and like maybe some drawings are the only thing I did in 2018 so this year I want to do more art I want to do more painting in particular even though painting is kind of expensive my favorite paints are like these Liquitex heavy body paints and they can get pretty pricey especially because I like to lay it on thick with the paint man I'll just try and make a budget for paint so that I don't have to worry about it because if I'm worried about not having enough paint then like I'm not gonna paint. I am working on a painting currently which I've been working on for the past two days. Um, it's not finished yet and I'll put a picture up when it's finished. It's still kind of drying right now. It's stuck a little. But it's like a freaky kind of big old like I don't know if you can see it. It's like it's basically like a painting of a person, but like not quite a person. But you can tell it's a person. You know what I mean? Like there's not like facial features except for like the side of the glasses. But then it kind of just the angle is not good for this. It disappears. But anyways, so this one is different because look at this this stuff right here. I mixed some paint some gel retarder which is the stuff that makes your paint stay wet longer but it also gives it a really weird texture and you know mine's really old so it might be that but um gel retarder paint and then i put in these little beads that are used in foam slime so those little beads made like a lot of texture like you can see all the texture on this I love it and then on this part on the flat parts all of this paint see how thick it is all of this almost looks like wet concrete from really close up and you can't really see it very well but um, I mixed glitter into the paint 
because glitter, first of all, I thought it was useless and horrible because I hate glitter. But glitter doesn't actually, this empty tube, glitter doesn't actually have a pigment, it's just colored. So you can put it in any paint you want to give the paint texture and it won't change the color of the paint. Glitter in paint makes together a lot of glitter, makes it like clay almost. I don't know, but it's amazing. So I'm trying that out. So that is not finished yet. I'm finishing it right now as, as I'm trying to film this video. I did the whole painting so far. Well, yeah. Yeah, no brushes for this one because I do that sometimes. I do weird little, um, like I'm gonna, my self-portrait I made earlier in the year was only used or was only painted with a palette knife, a very thin triangle shaped, like very thin palette knife. And this one, the whole painting was done with this spoodle looking thing. It's like a little paddle that uh, came in a slime making kit. I'm like trying to paint, but then like stay in the camera shot. That's why this is a weird video. It's just an impromptu video, okay? And it's really for myself because I really want to make more content. And that's my next little thing for 2019 is to make more content. And it doesn't even matter which content I make. Like really, this the newest video I've made so far is that cringy little medical video that I had to make for class. I took an EMT course in 2018, I passed with an A, and I have my national registry exam on the 17th of January, which I don't, this video might be out before then, but I don't know, I guess I'll find out if I'm going to be an EMT. Trauma medicine is my special interest, so I really like trauma medicine, it's very fun, which is always weird to people out when I say that, but it is. I really enjoy it. I enjoy the concepts of it. I enjoy that you can literally save someone's life just with knowledge, even if you don't really have very nice equipment with you. If you know how to do like CPR, if you know how to stabilize a spine, just like anything, like you can save a life. It's crazy. My next intention for 2019 is less sugar. Now I know everyone says this. Everyone says like, oh, we're gonna go on a diet and we're gonna, no. Do the diet people lose some weight and I am literally eating Sour Patch Kids yes they're in a paint bucket I'm eating Sour Patch Kids while I'm doing this painting because sugar fuels my creativity <laughs> and I always have to like snack on a little sugary thing while I'm painting so that aside in 2018 I went off of sugar completely for about five months I lost 23 pounds just by going off of sugar I didn't do anything else I didn't eat more like by by the very practice of going off sugar I did have to eat like more vegetables just because I was craving like weird shit when I wasn't eating sugar like I would just want a whole plate of broccoli for no fucking reason and it was delicious and I would do it again so I'm gonna try and do that again in 2019 and I've been really good about not eating sugar so far Except for this particular painting. And probably future paintings. Let's be honest. I mean, if sugar helps your creativity, eat the sugar. Anyway, sugar gives me really bad brain fog. And it's hard to think. So, along with the brain fog aspect, another intention I have is saying what I want to say. Which is getting a little more deep in that. But saying what I want to say because... Every time I make one of these videos, I have to edit out all the uhs and so and hmms, ums, okay. Like, I just fill the space with noise if I can't figure out what to say. So I want to try more this year of figuring out what I say before I say it and not filling the space with noise, just filling it with silence. Let's be honest, it'll be a lot easier to edit videos if I'm not talking through the whole thing. Another 2019 intention was more activity. So I will walk the dogs more, do more things around the house, such as repairing things, fixing things, 
moving things around, cleaning more, just activity, just get up and doing things. And my next intention is less stress, which 2018 was very stressful. Not even from like political everything, but like a personal standpoint too. And there's a reason I didn't make any videos in 2018 is because it was just, I was having a rough, rough year, boy. Hopefully the addition or the accumulation of more art, more activity, less sugar, will end up being less stress, but also being more honest with myself, being more honest with others about who I am, what I can do, what I feel comfortable doing at the workplace, at home. This all sounds very ambiguous, but we're gonna work on it. We're working on it. Also, I don't think I'm gonna do the video game thing anymore. <laughs> video, like, video games are fun, but like for me, and I don't do very well commenting through the whole thing. So let's plays are very hard for me to do because I just want to sit in quiet and play the video game. I don't want to talk. <laughs> I want to do more art on my channel. I want to do more kind of weird little vlogging like this. I don't know. See, I can't focus on my painting now. I'm just going to focus on you guys. But I fixed the little part I wanted to fix, I think. And then I need to outline some stuff. It's a very textured piece, so it's nice. More reading. I've already kept up with this resolution in the last, like, month or so. I have been reading everything. So I got Audible, which I love because I'm usually really bad at just sitting down with a book and reading. But now I can start a book and do the laundry or do the dishes, which is harder because the dishes are loud. But art. I painted this whole thing while reading, like... Uh, I think I'm like 10 hours into the book of Magicka. Is it a book or a series? I don't know. It's 38 hours of crazy. So Audible is a lifesaver. It's helping me get on that reading, reading shit. More dates. I don't necessarily want to go out on more dates, but I want to have more little dates like cooking, I want to sit down and watch a movie with him. I want to just hang out with him. You know, like little things, just hang out. Maybe go to the store, watch a movie, play video games, cook a meal. We're good at cooking meals together. But we don't really, we aren't the type of people to really go out, go to a movie, go to a nice dinner. Like we don't really do that stuff. But I want to do more things together, if that makes sense. And the final thing I have on this is less stuff. We're trying to move to Seattle eventually. Probably not this year, but we want to have a plan by the end of this year. Like a for sure, like this is what we're doing. This is how we're going to move. We're going to Seattle. So we are getting rid of a lot of our stuff. Trying to downsize everything, which is hard when I keep making more paintings. But... <laughs> We're going to downsize a bunch of our house. So yeah, so hopefully I can at least get one video up. Like I said, making videos is fun for me and I wanna make more videos and I really don't care if anyone watches them. I really don't care for getting likes or views. I just want to make stuff that I like to make and Art is one of those things, and videos is another one, so we're just gonna work on me for a little while. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all later. This is The Real Shambles.